Hey, what's up guys, Growing the Hobby, coming back to you guys with another baseball break, another GTH baseball break, minus the GTH box. That's right, because we got essentially eight loose packs here today, which is what we normally pack into our GTH box. Uh, if you guys haven't catched the recent videos here, especially these baseball boxes, I forgot to uh, bring the GTH box itself. Uh, so this is just a loose pack break and stuff, which is essentially what the GTH box is. But uh, I forgot to bring it here with this cluster of videos that I'm make, kind of making here with all these baseball boxes recently and stuff. But uh, yeah, let's just get into it. No worries. I promise it will be back. So our loose packs today. Pinnacle 2013 Hobby Pack 2022 Series 1. 94 Series 1. 19 uh, National Baseball Card Day. 21 Bowman. And a rack pack, not fat pack, but a rack pack of uh, 1988 tops to uh, kind of revisit here and go back a little old school and check things out there because is the junk wax air and all i get that but still fun little rip and stuff and kind of reminds me of the childhood days and stuff where i was ripping this stuff you know quite frequently and just put them in my little backpack and everything else and i remember opening them like up in the driveway and stuff for some reason i used to ride around them on my bicycle pack my pockets with uh, baseball cards and go open them up somewhere, some random spot, and then pack them back in my pockets or a backpack and bring them home as I struggle, my gosh, mightily to open this rack pack, which, jeez, giving me a lot of issues trying to get this doggone thing open for some reason. And here is our third stack. I don't think anything great's going to come out of this. This one's more for a Stroll down memory lane because this is again 88 tops, kind of right there, smack dab in the middle of the junk wax era, but it's still a fun little rip. So, an all star Mike Scott to start us off, Harold Baines. Uh, let's see if we have anything Tim Wallach, Sparky Anderson, Alan Trammell, Tony Gwynn, Dave Schmidt, and flying through these just to see if we have. Kind of anybody that's noteworthy or anything like that, or Lou Pinella, that was a cool one. Sean Dunstan, a bunch of leaders cards there all together. Frank Viola, Yankees leaders. And a Rocky Childress is going to end that pack there. All right. On to, I guess let's do our other one where we can actually see the cards through the cellophane. That 19 National Baseball Card Day, still looking to pull. My first on-camera auto out of these. Pulled plenty of them off camera, but not on camera. Determined to do that one of these days here. So we got Miggy. Yeah, there's a nice Eloy rookie. I'll take that. It's a nice pull. We got Reese and the Polar Bear, too. How about that? Two nice rookies, at least. No autos. The non-auto pull streak is still alive on here, but the uh, the rookie pulls were very nice there. I'm going to do this Bowman pack here because I know nothing great is going to come out of this other than perhaps... Oh, kind of the big pulls here. You get two chrome cards. You know, I'm looking for a Blaze or an Austin. They're first Bowmans. And then uh, you can get some nice rookie cards here to, in the papers and stuff for the big leagues. But no uh, rookie cards there at all. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. There you go. Austin Martin. His stock's falling quite a bit. But that was the guy to get for sure at the time when this came out. Very nice little chrome in there. We'll set that aside. And Ivan Johnson. I keep pulling his... Uh, for some reason, I've, I've pulled his more so than I'd say anybody else on this product. Chris Morrell, first Bowman paper, and a Nick Allen prospect card there to end that one. Oh, let's go back to the 94. 94 Series 1. You guys can see I picked this up at my LCS for a big 75 cents. Feels a little glossy, so I wonder if there's any brickage in this one. Um, no, nah, not too bad, not too bad. They seem to just come right apart. Alex Gonzalez, Future Stars card right there. Maybe, well, maybe a little bit. You hear that? Just needed one little adjustment, I guess. Alex Gonzalez, Future Stars. That's kind of you know, cool looking stuff there. Is he is of course stuck right there? If you want to see the back of one of those, that's what that looks like. Then we got a Garrett Anderson, Future Stars there, and of course these are going to be every which way. This reminds me of the Stadium uh, Club right around that time. Tony Phillips, Joe Girardi. Rene Rocha. Alan Bennis, draft pick card. That's kind of cool. Robin Ventura, if we can get him to turn around. A little bit of stick of cheers you guys can probably hear and see. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. 
Tops Gold. Black Gold, that is. Pretty cool. Robin Venture. I'll take it. That's a cool pool. Uh, Jeff Schwartz, Tim Raines. I'm not sure if that black gold is one per pack or if that was a hobby box hit. I'm not really sure. Uh, Greg Litton. Mike Lansing. Oh, man. Some serious stickage there. That is a cup card. And then BJ Scherhoff. I'm not sure if we have any odds on here. I don't. Oh, there we go. Maybe a little bit of odds. Let's see. Whoa. How about that? I'll be dang. Look at that, guys. So Topps Black Gold card is one in 72 packs. That, that's a nice pull. I mean, it's not an insane pull, but that is a nice pull. One in 72 packs. Nice for a loose pack. Not bad. All right, 2013 Pinnacle. Terrible set, but it's all about the autos in this. I've had a lot of auto luck. Big guy I'm seeking that's on the checklist here is Mike Trout autos. That would just be insane. Brandon Phillips, you guys can see it's just horrible cards, though. Austin Jackson, make us flip these around every which way, too. And no auto this time because the autos are backwards when you pull one, but we got a Team 2020 Bryce Harper. Cool-looking card. That's not numbered or anything. It's just one of their little subsets. JV, Justin Verlander, and a Joe Maurer to finish us off in that pack. All right. 22 Series 1, still looking for Wander. Let's see what we can do here. Ronnie Dawson rookie card starts us off. Come on, where the heck are you at, Wander? One of these days, you would think I could pull it, but I have had no luck. And it looks like that is going to continue today. But we do have a Generation Now card. Gavin Lux, very rainbow foily. Not numbered or anything like that, but that's the subset. And then we end with... A stars of MLB, all rise for the judge right there. So you get one of those per pack in the uh, blaster boxes. So nothing too, too crazy there. Probably the two best cards of the entire break. Uh, the Austin Martin, first Bowman Crumb, and definitely the tops black gold, Robin Ventura. Um, you know, one in 72 pack bowl. So not too bad, not too bad. All right, guys, please do me a favor, like, subscribe, share, click that bell notification button to be notified of future videos. Lots more of them coming to you guys, as always, in the description below. You can find my email address, mailing address, and Instagram handle. Other than that, have a great day, a great night, wherever you all are at, and we will see you next time.